Thank you, Hannah. We're going to turn now to the latest on Gabby Petito. The story of the 22 year old's disappearance and death impacting people right here in the Cape Fear. Petito lived and worked in our area for a while. WWY Sydney Bouchelle spoke with those who knew her personally. I said, what'd you find out about her time here? Hi, Randy. Well, Gabby lived in Carolina Beach. She worked in Wilmington, and even though she didn't end up going, she applied to Cape Fear Community College. Um, Gabby was a bright soul, a bright light. She was always happy, always had a smile on her face, always trying to bring everybody up with her. Gabby Petito, a young woman whose story captured the attention of the nation after she went missing during a cross-country journey with her fiancé. Before the headlines, Gabby was a young woman living and working in the Cape Fear. She's not just a name. She's not just a case. Um, she was a person and she was very special to a lot of people and many of us here. Smoke on the Water General Manager Lara Witchin says Gabby worked there from September 2017 to January 2019 in the kitchen and as a hostess before moving to Florida. I think all of us here initially thought it, it can't be real. You know, it has to be somebody else. She was so full of life and had so many plans and had her whole life ahead of her. A life captured in photos, spending time with friends, enjoying the ocean and the Carolina Beach Boardwalk. Now some of those photos cover a table at Smoke on the Water, a table reserved in her memory. Gabby's friends are still shocked and heartbroken. They were not able to speak on camera, but shared stories. To know Gabby was to know someone who truly embodied a free spirit. She made life a little lighter and a little less serious. She was adventurous and loved her family and friends wholeheartedly. She enjoyed doing art. That is something that we shared a passion for, making the world a more creative and beautiful space. Her love for life was so inspiring and her love for others even more so. I am so thankful for the time I got to spend with her while she was in Wilmington. She touched my life more than anyone could know. Gabby, your smile will forever be engraved in my heart. On the coast of North Carolina, Gabby Petito will be remembered for her joy, her smile, and her heart. She was a good soul, a good spirit, and touched so many lives. That's what we want her to be remembered for. They plan on honoring Gabby by planting a tree outside of Smoke on the Water soon. In the meantime, they ask for everyone to send their love and prayers to her family.